Hello friends, so today we are going to uh, get to know how to create a virtual environment on XAMPP server. Okay, so first of all, uh, as we know, like uh, with this URL localhost slash whatever folder name you have, we can uh, have the PHP code available. So I have PHP info function, so you can see I want to run this url as a uh, uh, suppose i want to create a virtual environment with the name like local dot test okay local dot test so currently it will not work but i need to create a virtual environment virtual host so that i can call uh, my testing folder and localhost like this so what i will do first of all i will quickly go to as uh, a XAMPP folder then in uh, XAMPP I will go to Apache then in uh, conf then extra then I will just edit this virtual vhost file then open in my studio virtual visual studio code then I will just copy the last four five lines copy here then I will remove uh, these two lines because it is not needed only two lines are needed over here that is document root I will remove the comment symbol so that it will be uncommented so double hashes are removed now it is uncommented and I will use the path where my folder is there so testing is my folder I will write my testing folder name and then over here I what I how I want to call is local dot test okay and I will just save this file and one more file we need to edit where what where we will go for this in the run we will open the run then I will type drivers then okay then I will move to the drivers folder then we'll go to etc then edit this file host file make sure you have uh, permission to edit this file you can go to properties to check the permissions like suppose I have all the permissions. that is why I can see full control okay make sure you have all the permission to edit this file and then I will open this file open with visual studio or maybe notepad easily I can open I will just copy this and in the last I will type my virtual uh, host virtual host name that will be local.test and I will just save this file yeah now both the files edit part is done now what I have to do uh, to do is like uh, don't forget to restart the Apache I need to restart the Apache because I have changes in the configuration file of Apache that's it now what I will do I will try to run this and it should not work because I have changed the virtual environment hosting yes it is not working and this should work because I have created a virtual environment virtual now you can see hope you like this video make sure don't forget to subscribe the channel and like the video and share if you want to thank you